Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, it would have been nice if I had a new computer. Dang. We will. Oh, I will assist Goldie. you with this, Goldie. Sorry if I'm sounding a little. Um, the tech industry doesn't. It's suck. okay. Don't worry about it, bro. No, it's it just like I've, I've, I, I've barely been getting donations, and I've tried not to be a dick about it. Dude, it's frustrating. It's fine. People get frustrated. Yeah. You wouldn't be human if you didn't get frustrated. Stop worrying about it. I know. It's just I don't want to act like. What's her name? Bad Bunny. Hmm? The fuck? Dude, you're not demanding money. It's a choice people have. Alright. And, like, don't don't worry about it. Hold on, some of you... Like, all, it's like, all that's gonna happen is the worry is gonna mount on the stress, and then it's gonna make more stress, which is gonna cause more worry, and then it becomes a never-ending cycle of stacking and stacking and stacking. And then and you yeah. look at podcast. But just on... Like, but no, just on a different note, like, do some of you in the call not know who Bad Bunny is? I think that was like a clip I saw, maybe like, a, was that like the... the... I've seen Critical's review, I think. Yeah, the fucking like, $5... How did my whole speech it? thing about the last... There are regulars here! $5 a month! I'm like, wow, this lady needs to take a walk. It's like, like, oh my god, so you have five dollars, right, on your paycheck, surely. So you can Don't pay that much surely. money to someone <laughs> like me, because I am an entitled little brat. Oh, uh, please like... skip. <laughs> yeah, no. skip my I've, luck. Eaten, I've just eaten, and now all the taste is being replaced by something. My nose is burning for that voice. <laughs> no, that is... <laughs> no, like, I, I think I've heard recently that Bad Bunny got kicked off of uh, Twitch, which I'm like... About fucking time. Yeah, thank you. Right. <laughs> no, that's somebody who deserves <laughs> to be knocked off because despite how entitled and how, f like, I'm trying to find the right word, it's just... Like, despite her behavior, she gives a really bad rap to a lot of people who Twitch. It's mostly supposed to be for fun. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's like, for people who are genuine, it's just like, people are start getting worried now that, like, everybody's going to have that toxic thing. And it's just like, if I don't pay me enough money, you just pay me. That's not what all of them like at all. That's just what this one, one bitch does. Yeah. It's like, bratty, toxic. Okay, yeah, no, people in the chat are being a little, um, they're being supportive. Toxic, <laughs> arrogant, bratty, narcissistic, however you spell it. <laughs> Yes. I like, I like narcissistic however you spell it. Yeah. No, it's honestly, like... I, honestly, I want to say, it's a really friggin... It's a really good judge of character if you don't know how to spell narcissist. No, no, here's the, here's the hilarious thing to say. Uh, toxic, arrogant, bratty, or narcissistic. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. yes. Also, real, also yes. real quick, I wasn't is like I wasn't making fun of the person who couldn't spell narcissistic. I was saying that since you can't spell narcissistic, you're probably a decent person. <laughs> yeah, you know, you consider yourself a decent being, or you you're you consider yourself a little more pure because narcissistic is the last word you would want to hear. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I think I just destroyed Rinkai's purity. <laughs> just by mentioning that. <laughs> but then again, he Sorry, actually God. Uh, but, but then again, he actually mentioned the term, so... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My brain's trying to think hey, about how you spell now? narcissism. Uh, honestly, I don't know. Like, I thought it would be fun to do... Like, the Among Us one was fun. Uh, uh, was a fun idea. It's just... I, I'm looping yeah. the argument again. Uh, among us. Hang on. It's have you... Like, have, I wish we... Oh, sorry. <laughs> Go right okay, ahead. do you want to go first or should I go first? Y you go first. Okay, so Among Us would have been fun. Like a ton of fun. Even if it wouldn't give me imposter. Again. But, you know, <laughs> would have been a grand old time. But fucking... What... Are there any other games you have? I have... Uh, okay, I have plenty of Steam games. Um, But I also want to, like... I'm also looking for... Games that are more multiplayer based. In fact... Have any um, of you ever played Duck Game? No. I've heard about Duck Game. Duck game I, don't no. I hear that game is really good. I've seen what the game you? play. It's it's kind of like it. it's kind of like Smash Brothers, but with guns. Oh. <laughs> Hell yeah! I don't have it and uh, cannot spend any money this week. Oh. How much is it? It's like fifteen dollars, maybe even That's less. That's too much for me. 
that's fifteen dollars. <laughs> no. I don't have. No, I could I could just imagine like Robin will say like, okay, fifteen dollars is too expensive. Okay, one dollar. That's too expensive still. <laughs> well, I'm gonna. I, I, I don't feel comfortable talking about how much I'm about to spend on the uh, MST3K Kickstarter, so I'm about to just put it in the chat. Um, that's how much is being taken out of my account on Friday. Oh, wow. Okay, no, I don't, no, okay. one, no one repeat the sound loud, just as a, just as a yeah, general yeah. respect thing. Oh, dear. Yeah. I don't no, feel I comfortable like, I, saying it, because that's a lot of money, and I, I don't feel comfortable right. talking about yeah, all I make. No, like, all I, I will say is, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing, I was that. gonna be that snarky hoe that's like, I mean, considering how much you spend on, like, Mystery Theater Science Mystery Theater, Theater 6000, 6, whatever the fuck it's called, <laughs> yeah. but considering game? everything no, no. that you, <laughs> considering that you spent that much money on that, I don't think a game is something you need right now. <laughs> and that's... The saddest thing is, I'm still gonna have to pay like shipping costs for stuff as well. <laughs> That's not gonna be calculated into that until like after the. <laughs> it luckily, thank <laughs> fucking god, I don't have to pay the shipping fees until like next week, because uh, I don't get paid until next week. And so like this is literally all the money, Mike. <laughs> and I might Aww. still go higher. Aww. I still have a. There's a little bit more wiggle room I have, and uh, Ooh, I might uh... add on one more T-shirt. Uh, hold as, on, hold like, on. They, they... Yeah, I spent too much money. But, uh, okay, so I can only pick one so far. That's about like uh, a little bit over a month of uh, oh, a little bit wanna, over a month of wanna, for me. I want to play a little game re real quick. Okay, so Twitch chat and anybody else currently viewing Golden's Twitch, um, how many channel points you guys got? I'll go first. I have nineteen thousand seven hundred and ninety channel points. Seventeen thousand six hundred and fifty. I have 17, like a couple. 700. I have a couple. Where do we figure this out? Yeah. Okay, so on the Twitch page, if you on the like on the right side where all the text chat and stuff is, just below that, there should be this purple circle with a number next to it, oh. just under where you type messages in. Okay, like, I only have two thousand two hundred eighty points. I don't. Hmm. I have eleven. I'm too lazy to check. Like, You're listen, I'm. Check. <laughs> It's like if your it's like if your number's really big, like it's showing something something point something k. If you hover over it, it should give you an exact amount. Oh, I think my estimate is at least over twenty five k. Jesus! <laughs> oh my god, I blue griffin had... with the fifty nine thousand six hundred thirty two. Oh my god! Yeah, so I think blue griffin. All right, so that. Robin, um, golden first to send me again. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on. Read, read the message I typed. Happy Wait. early birthday, bitch. You're four months you early. What have you done? <laughs> you gave me duck. Hey guys, I have duck game now. I can play duck game. Okay, I'm gonna. Happy you wanna, Golden? I'm gonna make you feel. I'm gonna make you laugh really hard because I don't think I'm gonna have time to play tonight. I think I might have to go to do something for work. Oh. All right, that's fine. I just decided, oh, you know, me do it. It would be fun. It would be an idea to do in the future. <laughs> yeah, I got an email. It's like Steam. I got. A, it's like you got a gift copy. I'm like, what the fuck? Who gifted me? And then I looked at the Golden. chat and so was like, we should probably gift Robin Ducky. I'm like, no. I was literally about to say, no. You know, don't give me anything. Like, guys, it's fine. This is my decision to spend way too much money. I'll be fine. Like, I have a paycheck coming in a couple weeks, and that'll you know help me have some money. I don't really care. Or you know, buy a T-shirt. I don't give a shit. Um, and then, uh, and then I just I was like, I then looked over and like. Oh, something that gives them like okay i'm gonna thank them and just be like okay thank you guys so much uh and then you know i'm, I'm not gonna play tonight because thing and then i saw who it was from like god damn it <laughs> <laughs> I, that, golden you have the same level of persuasion that i have and i'm proud of you <laughs> okay, galaxy so, uh... has the same thing where galaxy would be like oh i'm gonna buy you this i'm like don't do that that's money <laughs> don't spend Jeez. money on like, me there's been a and number then galaxy of there's been a good number of people who have like bought me games, and I'm like, half the time I'm like, shit, how do I even play this game? You know? And then, then Galaxy like, will. Uh, th this usual conversation is, 
Galaxy will say, hey, I'm going to buy you something. I say, don't buy me something. Buy yourself something. Galaxy will then go, I bought you something. I'm like, god damn it. Too late. Oh, no, I bought it. Galaxy, you did all the perfect responses. Oh, that's what that is. Yes. I bought you something for me. <laughs> I'm not doing this. I bought you right. something from me. Sincerely me. <laughs> Believe <laughs> me. me. Yeah, no, I'm not the only one who knows that. Listen, I'll pay. I'll pay you back for it whenever you make the orb menu shirt. I. <laughs> oh. oh wait, Robin. Robin. What? How many poses do you need? <laughs> listen, listen. Yeah, we'll see. It depends on how much money I get. Do you in my want last me paycheck. to make you sixty poses, Robin? Not now, because I don't think I can afford it now. <laughs> you, you want me to make 60 make... poses for you, Robin? Robin, you realize by Josh saying- Oh rated. shit! Josh just fucking Josh. rated me. Hi, Josh! <laughs> this is awkward Hi, because Josh. you haven't got a game to play. <laughs> we don't have a game. Oh god. We're talking about how much- how little money we all have. <laughs> oh dear. I've got a- I feel like I'm the poorest one here because the only time Bish, I get- I have nothing! I am... I have actually exactly nothing. No, no, here's the thing. I have a mixed situation. Um, because it's like, okay, I have to spend a lot of money soon because, um, basically a couple years ago I was disabled, so a lot of my payments got behind, but I had to cover it immediately because of another situation that popped up because of that. So, I'm just like, oh, hi, uh... I, I'm going to be spending a lot of money. But then they're like, oh, hey, uh, there's a backload on Amazon, so you have a mandatory overtime day. That does suck, but that does mean I'm getting more money, so that the financial part kind of evens out. I just don't like that I have to work mandatory overtime hours. Oof. I typically don't spend much money on things, especially for myself. This is, like, the most I probably spent on myself for anything. Maybe my computer, but that's also, like, to, you know, make videos. You know, so I don't really consider that like spending it on myself. Uh, yeah, that's the most I've ever spent on any one thing for myself. <laughs> I could just no, Robin, Robin. Yeah. I could just imagine like if we like when we get to meet at BabsCon, I would literally pull you to go to like <laughs> the fucking vendor halls. Like, do you want anything? Like, what? what? No. <laughs> like, no, I have money. It's like, no. like, no, it's fine. I can buy you something if you want. I can spoil you. <laughs> Now, I am much more likely to spend money on other people, because uh, I, I like giving people stuff, because it's like, here, have a thing. Yay. Yay. I'm, it's like, I am... I know this feeling. Like, the thing about me is, when I have money, Ugh. I usually spend it on in-game stuff in Destiny or Warframe, because Ooh. that's the kind of person I am. <laughs> also, nice. I spend stuff for my, uh, for either, like, my RA job, or... God, next year's gonna be so bit. so uh, I don't the know if I'm talking about batch. this on stream. Hang oh on. yeah, the new Star Wars thing. The Star Wars The Bad Batch. Mm -hmm. They're doing a series about the fucking Bad Batch? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. The first episode I've, is really good. Trust I've, me, the I have stepped away. Really I've stepped away from Star Wars for a ridiculously long time. And it's mainly because of just the toxic background that... I fucking just, hate yeah. talking about Star Wars at this point. Okay. Yeah, it's well, just... I will... it's, I mean, fair, but if you enjoy it for itself, then it should I love be Star Wars. I just oh yeah, no, I enjoy Star Wars itself. It's just like uh, the people are so bitchy over everything. Yeah. 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 What, I will, what I will say is that there's a lot of stuff in Star Wars that I look at and go, I could do without you. But anything involving the clones, I love. I love the Fets. I love yep. Mandalorians. I love clones, and I love the fucking Bad Batch. Yeah, and uh, Logic. Uh, so this is when Lo this is the part of the stream where Logic and I talk about the Bad Batch for a while, uh, where no one else has any goddamn interest in it. It's so fucking good. Like it is entirely focused on this group of characters. They are so god. Like I was kind of met on them in season seven of Clone Wars. Like I was like, okay, they're kind of interesting, but I I have other clones I love. Um, they're so fucking good in this series. I'm so fucking interested to see where they take these kind of concepts that they're playing with. I have wanted a show or something in Star Wars to cover what happened day one of the Galactic Empire, and this finally does. And it's like, holy shit, this is everything I wanted. That sounds cool, though. It is so... There is literally a scene, and I'm, I'm not going to spoil things, but there is a scene yeah. where, they, where they contextualize a scene from uh, Revenge of the Sith 
by showing its perspective on Kamino. And, like, I literally sat there and was like, holy fuck, they actually made this so much more intensely interesting by just showing it from a different right. perspective. Also, like, I do want to say real quick, I haven't seen anything super recent about the Bad Batch, so whatever was happening on Tuesday. I know the Bad Batch from the Clone Wars animated yeah. series. The Bad Batch started the I love them. They started a series about the Bad Batch. It started on Tuesday. The first episode came out. It's an hour and 14 minutes, so it's a little bit more than a normal episode. It's like two normal episodes. Mm. Uh, and it's so good. Echo is the best boy. They're all the best boys. <laughs> They're all gay, all... and they all love each other very much. This is oh a Disney God. Plus thing, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it it's is. Oh, damn it. Damn it. Yeah, well, it hold on, hold on. We can, like, somebody can screen share it. Wait a minute, I got I got something for you. Um, give me a minute. Hey, Rob. Rob the pirate back. Also, for anyone in the Twitch chat who doesn't know about the Bad Batch, because the animated series of the Clone Wars has been out for a really long time, so as far as I'm concerned, the spoiler embargo is gone. So, the Bad Batch are basically clones with beneficial mutations. Because sometimes, during the cloning process, a clone can go wrong, a clone can be weaker, a clone can be dumber, a clone can be just like just a mass of something I'm a clone trooper and I can shoot yeah. things yeah sometimes <laughs> right it's like sometimes a mutation goes really well in their favor like a mutation that makes them seven feet tall and tough and literally tough as nails or something that makes them super intelligent and able to work tech like a droid Oh, nice. Or give them like greater commanding skills, make them better at stealth and other things. Hey, I, yeah. I gave you guys and my definitely like the bad good, batch, and legal, uh, good and legal Disney Plus link. Yeah. Let me let me ask yeah, you this: um, Is it required that you would have to watch anything with Clone Wars before watching the Bad Batch? It helps that it, to know like you, who the Bad Batch are. There is a there it, is a series of three episodes in season seven of Clone there's Wars. There's supposed to be a total Clone of sixteen, according to what I looked up. But yes. Well, no, okay, seven, so the seventh season was what on I Disney Plus, say, and, okay, I, well, you go. I haven't seen anything about this new Bad Batch series, so I have no idea how important it is, but, like, the Bad Batch is introduced in the animated series, but I'm going to assume they'll do a nice enough job of explaining them in this series as well, <laughs> so maybe it's not super, super important. No, you kind of need to see the three episodes that introduce them in season seven, oh, okay, fair, fair. because, like, it expects that you understand. Hey, this is who the bad bat. This is who the bad batch are. These are the characters. This is kind of the basic dynamic of them. Echo just joined, and Order sixty six just happened. That's all you need to know. Like it, it, it introduces it right before Order sixty six, yeah. but you oh. kind of need to know who these guys are just so that you kind of understand. Like you can understand them kind of from just like their basic design you can go like oh he's the brute force guy he's the leader he's this but like there's a little bit of that kind of lore stuff where it's like oh echo was one of the clones in the clone wars but he got fucked up when he was kidnapped so then he became like this kind of half robot this kind of cyborg thing and he joined the bad batch at the end of the episode where they were introduced that's that is like something that's explored a little bit in the pilot, and it's not really explained because it expects you to kind of have seen the last oh, okay. season of Clone Wars. I was just assuming that, like, I was just assuming that, like, a lot of Star Wars stuff, it's really accessible because there's not a lot to it. But this time, because it's a, yeah, because it's, I context, of, it? because it's a spinoff of Clone Wars, it kind of helps you yeah. remember Clone Wars. I didn't rewatch the three episodes before seeing the Bad Batch, but I did remember who the Bad Batch were. I was like, oh yeah. <laughs> Here's the, these were those guys, this is what they did, yada yada yada. So yeah, forget everything I said, because I'm a fucking moron. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I was like, Logic, I, I was like, Logic, it. I've seen the episode, let me talk! Okay, I'm sorry. No, it's all I just, good. I just, get really I just get really giddy about anything to do with the Clone it's Wars. It's so good. It is. <laughs> oh, I was same. watching it. I love Clone Wars. I love Clone Wars so much. I love Bad Batch. I am so... I'm so interested to see where they're taking it because they're in, they introduced a couple of ideas that I was like, wait a minute, this is something. I can feel something here, and I don't know what it is, but it's interesting. I'm not going to spoil sure. it because it is very new. Like it came out on it came out two days ago, so I don't feel like talking about it. But uh, nice. I really I'm really excited about Bad Batch. Nice. Also, uh, Robin, the bad okay. bit. The bad bitch. <laughs> yeah. Robin? Um, yeah, 
Fucking this new this new Bad Batch series is it animated? Yes, it is. Yes, sir. It's yeah. the same style Clone yeah. Wars. Yeah, it is beautiful. It is somehow like every time they do something in the, with Dave Filoni, you know his kind of mini st- like Clone Wars Rebels, uh, Clone Wars season seven, and now Bad Batch. Every time they go back to that style, it gets better somehow. Like this looks better than season seven of Clone Wars, which looked better than. Um, Rebels, which looked better than seasons one through six of Clone Wars, which looked better than the movie, which I still say everybody's like the movie is the worst Star Wars movie. It's like no, it's not. It's just it's a good it's it's fine. It just loses steam like a third of the way through, and it never picks mm-hmm. back up. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, Bad Batch, Clone Wars. Please, everybody, watch it so I can be a goddamn nerd on this stream. <laughs> oh, I will say this as far as any Star Wars movie goes the only one that I really can't stand is Attack of the Clones that is it yep that's my uh, that's mine I'm like I just uh, the movie it's, is man. Yeah. it's, it's course not the greatest you're it's, 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 it's everywhere peace but it's, he, it's so he good sends a bounty hunter who hires a bounty hunter it who is sends a, who Robin. sends a robot who sends worms to kill Padme. Oh, I love that fucking face. <laughs> oh. That's a good man. clip. Who sends a man? Who sends a man? Who sends a robot? Who sends bugs to go kill Padme? <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. How many people? Like, if it was like, oh. Wait, wait, hold on. Aeon. Aeon, you were saying anything? No, I was saying, who sends bugs to go kill Padme? Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad that we all love talking about you know, Variety <laughs> Hour. I love I love Marcus. He's so fucking good. Uh, I, I watch that clip like almost every couple of weeks where I just because I think about like who sends a man, who sends a man, who sends a robot, who sends a bug to kill Padme. <laughs> <laughs> and the, and the top it all off. While the, like, the Jedi are chasing, while the Jedi are chasing the shapeshifter, Janko has a chance to go kill Padme. But instead, he goes out of his way to assassinate the assassin he hired to go to kill Padme. Padme. Assassin and the assassin. Secret the assassin, the assassin, the assassin who takes the bugs. robot who sent bugs to kill who Padme. Who sent bugs to robots and therefore sends an assassin for an assassin. Uh, Listen, I'm surprised Django didn't hire somebody else to send to send a robot to send. I'm surprised send Django bugs to didn't kill the fucking do it himself. <laughs> yeah, you would think. You would think oh that like God, yeah. greatest assassin in the galaxy, like the best the best bounty hunter in the galaxy, and like somehow is like he subcontracts out. You know, killing the senator by by hiring a shapeshifter who oh. hires a Doing robot who hires bugs bar. to kill Have Padme. Holy Jeez. shit! What? 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 The gamer girl. Th- oh my god! What? what? That is damn. Um. Whoa! Hey. Yeah. Whoa. The gamer girl. Holy shit! Holy. Shit! Thank you what? very much for that. You didn't have to do that. God damn! Can we all? Can we all like? Holy! Again, I see. I see them. Walk, yeah. I see them walking away, trying to be inconspicuous a bit. But can we get a hashtag out for them? Just like again, whatever's appropriate to say. Hey, we're playing Wait. Minish Cap, I guess. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> hashtag <laughs> Minish Cap. I, Holy I'm, shit! I'm <laughs> like you were just. Hey. You, the way you said I'm... it was so good. You're like, "Holy shit!" And we're like, "What?" And you're like, "Oh, Holy shit!" And we're like, it's cool. "What?" Nice. It's Courtney. Oh, Cor- what are my patrons say? Courtney, can you even afford that? I'm confused. <laughs> Courtney's one Courtney's one of my uh, highest patrons. Courtney. But also, like, she used to go with a different username. That's how I didn't recognize her at first. Fuck. Nice. <laughs> Also, Courtney, you need to start telling me stuff. I didn't know you changed your name. Well, that's Hi, Courtney. Well, to be fair, I think she probably changed it a while back, and I didn't even notice it. Yeah, yeah. Let's get a thank you, Courtney, in chat. Thank you, yeah, Courtney. thank you, Courtney. Thank you, Courtney. Thank I'm you, just like Courtney. I see that, and I'm like, fuck me, that's a lot. <laughs> I just love that you were like, holy shit. And we were just like, what's going on? And you just said, oh, and your response like, was saying, holy shit. Like, and we it's like you. I'm just like, say, what the? And I'm, you're like. You're like what? I'm like, I can't even find the right words. I will, 
I will say I'm not gonna I'm not gonna pretend I was in on it or some shit like that. But it was like I had a feeling. I had I a heard feeling Gordon over a big yelling, donation. And I looked at the stream and I'm like, I'm about to see something in 15 seconds. Anyway. And then yeah, you know, was... 15 seconds and I saw something. Oh, I literally okay. was like, oh, ha, ha, you know, just watching the stream and it's like, oh, that's what it was. Like, the sequence went perfectly. <laughs> God was like, oh shit, and then Robin was like, wait, what? Oh shit, and I was like, oh. <laughs> Wait, what? I was confused and I was like, oh, someone donated that much. Okay, cool. That's <laughs> now Dolphin has oh. exactly two hundred. <laughs> 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 fucking, fucking Galaxy's like, oh, okay, that's a lot of money. So oh shit, new, new, holy shit, new Space Jam movie. <laughs> so how, yeah, it was how, just uh, like... How far off is the upgrade now? Okay, um... <laughs> I will say this much after I take care of my <laughs> utility bills for this month and pay for rent in advance, I'm going to hopefully spend the rest of the month saving the fuck up to get money. Also, um, my ad revenue is going to come in this month, so that's a plus. Ooh, Yay. Sexy. Also, What's Robin. That? Yes. This is for this is for Courtney. Uh, Robin. Yes. What do you get when rabid fans have guns in space? <gasps> what do you get? <laughs> she, she, she left. <laughs> Galaxy. Robin. She purposely left the call. <laughs> Was that a goof? Was that I a get it. Goof? It's space. You can't hear anything. Uh. No, no, no. What? No, no. No, I, I didn't even finish my fucking. Thing. What do really? you get when rabid fans have guns in space? I don't know. Wars. What do you get when rabid fans have guns in space? Star Wars! <laughs> I like that I said it wow. before Logic just went, I don't know, what do you get? These are my friends, I love them very much. These are my friends, I love them very much. <laughs> Golden, Golden, not Golden. Shout Galaxy. out to Courtney for that donation for <laughs> Golden. I am so glad that when you dropped, it was so perfectly timed. I was like, oh, I'm, get, I'm like, that's the joke. Okay, <laughs> funny. And then the joke no. was somehow so much worse. <laughs> No, the thing is, I wasn't even, like, I thought I was kicked out. That's why I left. <laughs> I didn't even know, notice it. Oh, no, yeah, no, your internet was beat up, bitch. Yeah, so and also it was my phone, too. It's like, so your <laughs> bitch likes some bananas. I was waiting for somebody bananas. to say that. Bananas. I was waiting for somebody, was waiting for somebody <laughs> to say that. <laughs> <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> I hope somebody clipped that. I hope somebody clipped that. Well, hang on, hang on. Let room. me check. Let me check. Uh, do, 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 do. I always got to refresh it. So that way I will know. And no, there wasn't. Oh, darn it. Yeah. Ooh, I've seen that man, there's like, man. there's probably like three clips of the same scenario where I accidentally shot out the, um, the F-bomb over the oranges. Um, there's a... <laughs> There's just a there's a clip that had, doesn't have a name. It just says Golda Fox plays Donkey Kong. I'm like, well, okay. Golda Fox plays Among Us. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm really thinking that the uh, the the Among Us one is probably going to be me like, hey, Myth, can please please Myth, I need you to stop on the ladder. <laughs> that one was so fucking funny to me. Hey, Robin. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh dear. This will end well. <laughs> is GB no. hungry? <laughs> I don't know. Is BB hungry? Also, I see. No, BB eight. <laughs> I... Oh my god! Shut up! I would like to announce my official retirement from the Golden Fox podcast and all future Golden Fox here... dreams. No, wow. no, it's, this is more like here lies the hopes and dreams that Golden Fox had after the several puns have taken him away. <laughs> I had to do one for good measure. I hope you're proud of me, Golden. I like how you literally- I didn't even think about it being a Star Wars joke. It literally fucking blindsided me. I was like, oh. <laughs> no, hold, hold on. We can- I, here's something that, oh, like, Sleepy and I can enjoy doing. Hey, Sleepy. What? Kong fucking Lao. Kong fucking Lao! <laughs> No, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, uh, we, 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 we've been gushing over the uh, recent Mortal Kombat movie. Hey, yeah, that was pretty good. I got, I got if I just, like, freaking, because I'm just reflexively, like, 
you know, skeptical about video game movies, I decided nah. But if I had known that the, that movie was going to be good, I'd have joined you guys for it. I will say this much. If, if you're going to try to watch it for the plot or the story, you're going to fuck yourself. The movie is there for the dumb, fun action, and there's an awesome scene where Kung Lao shines so well, and I'm not going to give out any spoilers because it's too good to be true. Ooh, hey guys, cool. Also, uh... Yes. Hello, Kayla. Hello, Dusky. I kiss you both. Welcome back. Yes, he do. Are you any closer to figuring out what eat a bag you desire? <laughs> oh God! I already uh, bought one, Kayla. I'm not letting you buy one for me. <laughs> no, I just want to know which one you got. Hey, hey, Golden, you should oh, look at the chat. I'm not telling you. I don't trust that. What? No, What's up, Robin? You, you should me. look at the chat, Golden. Tell me. In the. So I can buy you pins. Hold on. Because hold on, they hold on. like to convert. I'll, I'll message you. I literally, I, I just I was like, it. okay, no, everyone's talking about like Mortal Kombat, and Robin, I just, uh, you're I just fired. Yeah, I got fired. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> oh, well, Robin, 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 Hey, hey, Gold. Hold the breed. <laughs> yes, oh, yes, yeah. Galaxy. Um, what kind of car can can what kind of car takes you to a Jedi? What kind of car takes you? Oh, is it a, a Toyota? Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> I am face palming right now. No, <laughs> no, hang on, hang on. <laughs> no, it's like, hey, Sleepy, I have a joke for you. Um, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what kind of car? What? Where does Darth uh, Vader get his designer shoes? No, hold on, Robin, Robin, hold on a second. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, Dust yeah, is okay, talking. Robin can go first. That's okay, Robin, go first. I just have another pun for him. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm going to finish off my joke because I know that Robin was doing. Please. Yeah. What? It's like, hey, Sleepy, what kind of car yes. do I drive? Yes. Did did I cut out? Toyota. <laughs> a Toyota, no? Galaxy <laughs> just snoping on the bit. Funny joke. <laughs> Funny joke. <laughs> oh, please, please do not do that again, please. Oh, here we go. I actually have I have Galaxy turned down like fifty percent on Discord. <laughs> what what is it like? What is a Jedi's favorite candy? <laughs> hey, I don't know, what's the Jedi's favorite candy? A lifesaver! Funny mm. <laughs> joke! Uh, how, uh, how does Wicked get around Endor? How? How? He walks. <laughs> he walks. Oh. Yes! <laughs> mm, I have a joke for you, Golden! Oh god, okay, Robin, fire away. <laughs> What hobby did I pick up in Germany? Of what? How did you pick up in Germany? What hobby did I pick up in Germany, Golden? What What was the hobby? Yodeling! <laughs> oh, God. Thank you, Courtney. Wait, Courtney, Robin. Courtney, you gave me, you gave me the pun, you gave me the punchline. I, I read only just yodeling, and I was like, that's so fucking funny. I need to use it for something, and then I... Robin, Funny mm. right. joke! Oh, hey guys. please do not do that <laughs> again. Hey guys. Yeah, yes, let's like keep throwing them mics. No, no. Who's, Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? General. General, General who? who? Well, hello there. Hello <laughs> uh, 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 there. Hello there. Hello there. General Kenobi. Yes. General yeah. Kenobi. Yes. <laughs> Star Wars character works at a restaurant. What? I don't know who. Darth Vader. <laughs> Why? 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 Why though? Does you know where he works? Yeah. Okay, I accept. <laughs> Des, Robin. He works at Pizza the Hut. Nice. <sighs> Spaceballs, nice. Yeah. Yeah. There's, there's a pun and a Spaceballs reference. <laughs> Fantastic. I can bear with that. 
Haha. <laughs> 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 I can. <laughs> I still love that logic. Knock knock. Who's there? General. General. Who? Hello there. <laughs> Hello there. Kenobi. I thought he was gonna be like General Kenobi, but no. It's like you knew when it was coming, but it was like. <laughs> Someone should make a compilation on how many times Golden slams his controller. No, I this, was, I'm considering the... making this just an additional like shenanigans night. <laughs> Um, no, there was something else that was in my head that I wanted to mention, and it com it's completely left my fucking brain. Hey guys. No, while, okay, while you're searching for that, hey guys. Yes. I have some I have some neat little factoids for you. Little factoids. Falcons, <laughs> Falcons can live to be 12 to 15 years old. Oh my fucking All god. Falcons. No, hold on a second. All no, hold on, hold on. All Falcons alive today were born in the 21st century. There are millennial Falcons. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, Courtney said that to me, and I was gonna read that out loud, but apparently Aww. she said it to a number of us. <laughs> Holy fuck! <Damn> it. <laughs> that is goddamn genius. Hey, hey guys. What? Yeah, guys. What do you call an evil, evil procrastinator? An evil procrastinator. I don't know um, what. What? Darth later. <laughs> I hate. That. Well, off to off to hang myself. No, <laughs> yep. We didn't let logic. We're not gonna let you. <laughs> you hey have to bear with us, Golden. <laughs> <laughs> it's not hey like these puns are unbearable. <laughs> we have to tell you the grisly details. Just bear with us. We barely. <laughs> hold, hold on, logic. Yes, what were you saying? Okay, so hypothetical question. If I put headphones on the sun, what do I get? I don't know, what do you get? What do you get? Hot ears? A death star. Ha <laughs> 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 Oh, god dang it. Oh, What's the baseball now... player's least favorite Star Wars movie? Spaceballs? No, the umpire strikes back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I wanted to. Okay, so this is kind of changing the. Su this is kind of changing the subject a little. Um, sure. Ah, oh, crap! I'll, I'll have to look him up. Like I know who he is. Okay, uh, like I remember the moment that I was uh, going to mention, but then I got to remember the comedian's name. Randy, that's his name. Okay, so there's a puppet guy. Who uh, is a comedian, and he like he does like stand up uh, humor, and he like one of the skits he talks about the color blue. Yes, I love that one. Just it's like, I uh, no uh, no that's not it. It's Randy something. Oh, okay. I I I don't remember his name. Like his last name, Brayden but Brayden can't have blue. Yeah, and it's like firstly, Brayden don't name can't your kid blue foods. Yeah, no, it's like firstly, don't name your kid Brayden, and secondly, <laughs> secondly, blue is not even a color for food stuff. Name me one blue food. Blueberry. Blueberries are fucking purple. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, can I just say one thing that my teacher said when we were studying serial killers and sociology and psychology? Yeah. Um, okay, so we examined one school shooting that happened, like, uh, it was sometime in the 90s. Like, it was either 94 or 98, I forget which one. Columbine? No, uh, Columbine was 92? Uh, no, Columbine was not 92, because Doom was released after. This was not Columbine. after. <laughs> Yeah, no, because there was a scandal about it. Um, uh, I'm sorry, I find that funny. No, but there was a, a school shooting where the school shooter's name was Kip Kinkle. Oh, and yes, that's who it was. the teacher responded with, um, you know, I'm not surprised. <laughs> I'm not surprised this kid would do a school shooting if their parents named him Kip Kinkle. Oh, that's a joke. Remember, this was like, Almost, mm -hmm. yeah, almost ten years ago, or yeah, literally. How is Kip a oh name? Imagine, Kiplin. imagine that newspaper clipping, clipping. Fuck, Kip. clipping. <laughs> imagine that newspaper clip. Just fucking Kip. Clip. I forgot his name already. <laughs> Never mind. It's past now. Moment's past now. I, I oh, all good. Know. But yeah, it's Randy oh, Feltface. That's who the puppet guy was. Oh my god. Ah. It's I'm like a, I'm just going cry. Right. It's like there's like cute. there's like a there's like a blue flavor of slusher. Like what the fuck is that? Highlighter. 
It's supposed to be mint. Mint is green. If you grew a plant and it came out as blue, you would set that you would shit, set on that fire. shit on fire. <laughs> No, 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 it's just cool. It's like ice. It's like water. Water, water is, is clear. clear. The only time water is blue is when there's billions of tons of it, and it's all in the one spot. And, and it's got all sorts, sorts of shit in, in it, like, like salt and sharks. And blue beach sharks in it. it. <laughs> Doing it, it's got sharks. <laughs> What have we done? We've devolved into like Just quoting other we've, jokes. We've devolved into <laughs> echoes of Randy Feltface. So uh, while we're while we're being dumb, I want to show you guys something <laughs> that I'm kind of that I started working on, uh, and it's uh, clearly it's taken so much effort. Um, let me. Adjust. We're just being us. Yeah, also and I'm topic. not going to show it to chat because. Uh, I don't know if this is actually going to be something I make or if it's just something dumb that I'm keeping up for a little. That it might be something I'm I. I make, but I have not decided yet. It'll <clears throat> save the copy. Uh, so this is, I guess, golden. You should probably wow. look at this. Here you go. Real quick, while Robin's. Oh my back. fucking god! <laughs> I really, <laughs> I really like that as the I design. Like <laughs> I was just expecting just only the text. <laughs> I mean, I do. that's funny, I but it. I like the idea of the circle. I like that it's off center from the shirt. Oh, oh god. god. It is. Actually, yeah, something that would something that would be funny. Something that would be funny. It would be funny if the text was like directly in the center of the uh, the circle. I'm. I, I've thought about that. I'm gonna make like four different versions of this. Probably um, make I, it I, Comic I, Sans listen, version. This is, font's already Comic Sans. <laughs> or make a vaporwave version then. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> well, I'm I'm expecting Golden to like make the actual like quality version of it, but I think I'm gonna put that on my story. Quality like, version. Yeah, quality all it is, is it's just like... gonna be fucking text. <laughs> Cause people will fucking buy it like hotcakes. <laughs> I, uh, chat, I can't even, if you wanna put it up on the stream, uh, go ahead, Golden. Cause uh, it's very funny. Uh, uh, Alright, so uh, if... chat, this is, I don't know if this is A, this is definitely not final, because I need to do a couple things on it. Um, B, I don't know if it's actually gonna go up on the store. Uh, but it is might it might be the the shirt that actually sells. I think a couple I bought I've sold, I've sold a couple of the um, Tales from the Fandom shirts. A couple of my friends bought those, but um, I, this might if this is the only thing that I ever make that sells, I will be very happy because it's very funny. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, yeah. Mm. On the topic of changing subjects, here's a subject that's always changing: the balance of the force. <laughs> <laughs> The balance of the board. AKA, AKA, it's own Dave Six Machina. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Ha ha, indeed. I, Riggin, I had to run through that like a hundred different times in my head just to make sure I didn't fuck it up mid sentence. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my world if that were the case. It's like, it's like over and over again, just crash coursing it in my head like a mannequin or something. It's like on the topic of changing subjects, his subject is always changing. <laughs> and on a different subject, Brayden can't eat blue. <laughs> Brayden can't eat blue. Apparently, I can do that voice because I'm autistic. It's like, apparently, he can't eat anything that is, has a blue color in it. Otherwise, he just just taps out. That is bullshit. <laughs> Second of all, blue is not even natural color for foodstuffs. <laughs> also, I that does make me curious, because like friggin' while rare in nature, blue does occur in nature, like blue flowers. But like, what constitutes blue in food? I honestly have no idea. Blueberries. Like the only is like the only blue I've ever seen in food is cake frosting. And what flavor is that supposed to be? Fucking highlighter? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no, I've tasted frosting like that. Oh. It's gotta be like blue raspberry or something, right? Something like that. Except raspberries don't come in blue, so what exactly is it? Whatever Tasty. it is, it has 75% pear juice. What oh, if, what juice? It's something unnatural, that's for sure. It's tasty. <laughs> also, it's tasty. real quick, like in Spinel Lover brought this up in chat. Ahsoka is best force user. That reminded me of something of a neat little theory I heard while watching some Star Wars videos 
about the Clone Wars because I live, breathe, and bleed Clone Wars and anything Mandalorian. But um, if I can, any anybody here familiar with the Mortis Gods? No. Yes. Um, no. Okay, Maybe? so to give you guys the basic rundown, there's this in the Clone Wars. There's this weird realm full of with these three entities in it called the Mortis Gods or the Mortis Gods. Oh, I yes, yes, I remember them. Yes, yes. father, yeah. son, and daughter. Yes, it's like there's the dark son, the light daughter, and the gray father between them. And I think there was a mother, but she became some kind of weird force wielding Cthulhu monster. <laughs> yeah, no shit, but that's not canon anymore. Yeah, I know. But, like, uh, so the thing with the Mortis Gods, and again, spoilers for Clone Wars, but again, it's been a really, really, really fucking long time. So that's not my fault. But, like, at some point, the, um, the daughter, like, the light side daughter, used their essence to save Ahsoka from dying. So, again. Ahsoka is basically running around with the purest essence of the light side of the force just kicking around in her body. <laughs> so yes, she is probably the best force user. Hmm. Yeah. Also, I find the Mortis Gods really fascinating. Because like all of the scenes involving them seem to imply that they are physical representations of the balance of the force. Even to the point where where one died, the other had to die to restore balance. Ye. They're probably rolling their they're probably rolling in their grave now that they know that their attempts to balance the force didn't really matter in the end. Oh, who just died? Who yeah. got bored of us? Caleb, no. Understand. Understandable. <laughs> Uh, but chat, if you guys uh, want to see what we've been laughing at when, it, when we keep talking about shirts and stuff, they're on my Twitter page. Uh, the two designs <laughs> that I've made. Slightly so far. off center. God, that would piss off Bliss so it's, hard. That's the idea. Is just so yes. they piss people off and like obviously, <laughs> hope the idea is hopefully Golden makes like an actual good version of it. I make this <laughs> shitty one that's funny. Hey, Robin, I could just imagine Bliss looking at it, and being like. Oh, God. Blow! No, no, no. Okay, wait, 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 guys, guys. What you have to do is make it off center, but make it very obvious, even when you're not, even when you are wearing the shirt. Because let's be real, you're not going to notice it's off center if someone's wearing it. True. That's. It, it will look fine if you're wearing it. <laughs> oh, you. you there you Solar, go. Wait, Jesus good one, Christ. <laughs> Solar. <laughs> He's typing into the goddamn chat. It's the back nice. of the shirt, Reese. You can find boobs in the orb. Horsemen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, you want to Nick also created a good one. The P no, that, that's great. Right. is stored in the orb menu. P is stored in the... What? The P is stored in the what orb the menu. What the fuck, Peter? <laughs> what? P is stored in the orb. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. The idea is that Golden would make like a very polished of it, like that looks really pretty, and I would make the dumb one. And part of me wants to see if I do put this out there, which one people would buy more of. Oh, see, here's the thing: you need to make it first and put it on your page, and then Golden Fox makes the good one, and his is the knockoff. <laughs> You've raised a good point. <laughs> 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 it's like a I just, thing. I love, I love what Myth typed here. <laughs> orb menu. Just orb, blue circle menu. <laughs> Wait, no, no, no. Orb menu. I mean, I am gonna make both a orb menu and a monkey shirt, probably. Yeah. I've really, I've, Welcome I've been trying to think about what the monkey Hello. shirt's gonna look like. If it's literally just gonna be a, a blank shirt with text that just says monkey. <laughs> Or if it's, yes. alternatively, the idea is that the front of the shirt is like this very intricate design of just different like letters that make it look like it's laughing, and then the back of the shirt just says "monkey" on it. Because I think that's funny, but that takes a lot Go of work. Back. To be intricate. I want to be monkey. I want to be monkey. I still love that April Fool's joke. I'm so proud of that one. It is. And I'm also proud of my own video where I, um, like, I was going to allegedly do a review of Princess um, Promenade. <laughs> just, 
Like, I make this long wall of text. The Princess Promenade, why it's an underrated classic, and everybody's wrong about it. No, it fucking sucks. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna get you. <laughs> like, oh my god. And then Golden just, like, hits, like, the sickest, like, choreography six moves, yo. Just just yeah. a also, bunch of quick, middle uh, fingers swinging, like, my uh, fist in a row, like, in a... In a wheel. What's up, Real quick, someone in the Twitch chat brings up something interesting because people are still talking about Star Wars. Uh, one could argue that the dark side was never meant to exist in the first place, and that bringing balance to the Force meant eradicating the dark side entirely. But that, no. Okay, no, 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 actually, so George. Lu wait, no, George Lucas actually did confirm that the entire point of light side of the Force is that the light side is the balance. The dark side is the in is any form of imbalance itself. That is oh. how you were meant to view it. I okay. But that's less fun. Maybe the that's real balance is four 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 to make along the way. Well, I, I hate that like a lot. Wait, what? You were saying something before. Oh, well, if like they were on the same topic, but like to me, even though now I know what the actual interpretation is supposed to be, but to me, and you know, the better way of thinking about it, and I'm just gonna call it that because, you know. Yeah. To me, the idea of balance is that there's light and there's dark. But not in the same way that everything has absolutes and everything is black and white, but as in there are two things and one can't exist without the other. Because think about it, if there was nothing but light, we'd all be blind. But if there was nothing but dark, we'd be unable to see. But dark things are shone, like light shines down upon dark things to give them color and make them visible. So in a sense, all things that are physical are darkness until light touches them. And I'm I'm talking about that in just general philosophy and not Star Wars. I realized I kind of led over into non-Star Wars. No, no, you're good. Uh, I'm into philosophy, but uh, that also implies a bias for golden mean fallacy. I thought you said golden meme fallacy. I'm like, what did go yeah. what meme do we have now? No, um, golden mean fallacy is um, okay. Originally, there was this concept of the idea of like the golden middle or the gold or golden median, which is to say, oh, the best. Um, everything are two ends of a spectrum, and the best thing to do is land somewhere in the middle. This was later found out this can rather easily be turned into a fallacy because you can warp what the supposed ideal middle is by just changing what the pole placements are, mm. and then the and then the all the integrity of the idea falls to pieces. Yeah. <sighs> <clears throat> hmm. But yeah, to um to answer Sir Straw Hat's original statement about the whole the dark isn't supposed to exist, even though the interpretation is that the dark is objectively evil and the light is objectively good, I much prefer to look at it as like both of them are necessary, but with the Jedi and the Sith, they're both being done in the wrong way. In fact, I want to bring this up to everybody, and again, this is just another one of my weird <laughs> philosophical interpretations of things like Star Wars and similar stories involving the objective good and evil of one and the other being light and dark. But to me, I feel like the light and the dark themselves are not good or evil. I don't think they're moral, and I don't think they lean in any Hey, to Kayla, can you mute? I think it's... Yeah. I, I'm it's hearing like, a I... bunch of noise coming from your end. That's oh, she's weird. Feedback. Hmm. What? You're you're getting feedback. Like I'm hearing us talking on you. Like a few. It seconds sounds off. very scratchy. Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay, sweetie. That's okay. Yeah, it's gone. The feedback is. Is it? Um, I don't well, know if I may uh, bring something up about that. Someone did bring up that. Um, another thing to look at, especially with stories, is you can't. Um. You can't always, not that you're doing this, but um, when it comes to interpreting stories, one could get, like, essentially postmodern and apply a theory to it that was never meant to be applied to it. Yeah. Um, but there's also that you could, um, if you view it in the way it's meant to be, you can understand, like, exactly what it means and what the interpretation is. For instance, um, there was this analyst, and he made the best Star Wars analyst videos ever made. He made two specifically that... They are long, but they are totally worth it, and I have sat through them all. And one of them was about the philosophy of Kreia from Knights of the Republic 2. Um, because she is, in my opinion, the best... Uh, she's, like, one of the best Star Wars characters, if not the best for me. 
she's basically Star Wars Nietzsche, but she has a really fascinating philosophy, and they say that, according to this guy, he makes an interesting claim. He um, first claimed that Kreia is pr would probably have been the only real example of a gray Jedi um, in philosophy, and then he made another video after this one because people <laughs> saw that as, oh, they're, it's aggrandizing the idea of like the gray Jedi and how that's the best. And he essentially just made an entire analysis video tearing down the concept because of how the Star Wars universe works and its internal mechanics and how the Force works are not the same as how um, we are able to t interpret, manipulate, and find a balance between philosophies here, like <laughs> on Earth in real life kind of thing. And that it's a, and that in his opinion, it's a mistake to view it that way. I because see. he also pointed out like the it's inevitable for a Grey Jedi to eventually fall under like. Essentially, it's a, he essentially described how it was a path of tragedy where it doesn't matter if you um, lean what side you have to be leaning towards, um, you you won't be sufficiently good enough at that side to um, essentially either just end in tragedy. Because I think he said, like, I forget what he said about the Jedi, and keep in mind, I don't remember all of his points, but he made several good ones, and these were not the best ones. Uh, one was, um, if you choose to be a, sort of a light-leaning gray Jedi, uh, most of those, and he listed a ton of examples, tended to be uh, typically inept, inactive, or, un or a vast majority of the time not actually willing to do anything to get them, like, in like involved. They're kind of just in the background and not doing much. Um, and if you try and do, like, a dark-sided gray Jedi you'll just inevitably fall to the draw of the dark side anyway, and you won't be any different than the other dark siders. Oh. All right. It's 11.30. I gotta get going. Have a All good right. everyone. I think it's oh, best that we call it. Desky. I think it's uh, best that we call it a night, because we've been kind of on this for a while. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's fun, though. It is. Logic, would you like that video? It's really good. Like, he explains his reasoning really well. Uh, sure. I don't see why not. Okay, cool. All right. Well, I'll be catching uh, you guys in the stream later. And uh, since I do have, I think I have Saturday off, so I can definitely run a podcast there. I've got some ideas that are under I my pocket, so I will unfortunately not be able to meet, make the podcast this because week because your job. I'm, well, yeah. A, my job, and B, I think I'm helping out with some final stuff before the end of this, this week and next week because it's so like the next three the next three weeks I'm pretty much going to be gone because. This week and next week, I'm helping with finals and other random bullshit, and then the week afterwards, I'm moving. I'm doing move out for my dorm building, and I'm going to probably be dead. <laughs> okay then. My, I and also, I won't have my computer set up anymore. My computer will be, you know, taken down in a box until uh, Sunday. Night, All right. So. All right. Well, have a good night, everyone. Night, everyone. Have a good night. Wash your fucking hands. Okay.